Hey guys, Joey Shanks here, and I'm here to talk about the future. And what I believe the future to be is holograms. So let's get to it and try to make some holograms, or at least create the illusion of a hologram. Now the classic technique called the Pepper's Ghost Technique has been used since the late 1500s. You create the illusion of someone in a room that's not there, kind of like a ghost-like figure. It felt like I was making a diorama, it was so easy, but so cool. So I recommend if you got kids, or if you just like doing stuff like this, go for it. It was fun. We all remember the Tupac Shakur hologram. Now technically that wasn't a hologram, that was the Pepper's Ghost technique. It was just done a little differently. You had your stage and then you had a projector going down and there is a huge mirror that then reflects it back onto the stage. I don't think we could ask for a more beautiful evening, don't you? The next step is to try to light a background to sell the effect even more. Because when it's just a dark background, you're just gonna have no perspective, no scale. You try to work on a base plate where your hologram is being projected off of to sell the effect as well. Maybe years away, but the groundwork is starting. Apple just secured a patent for a 3D system display that could create interactive 3D holograms. This shows you what direction they're eventually going to try to take the iPhone 9, 10, 11, 12, who knows what. Hopefully by watching this you've learned a little bit more about holograms and perhaps you can now create your own holograms and even become a hologram. Bye bye. <laughs>